It's described as majestic, unique, and of course priceless. It's the Madonna of Foligno, one of Raphael's greatest masterpieces. The painting was done in the Vatican by the great high Renaissance artist in the 16th century. Since then, it usually hangs in the Vatican's Pinacoteca Gallery. Raphael presents her as a beautiful Madonna. Interestingly, he gives the Madonna the face of his fiancée, the famous Fornardina. In September, the Pope will visit his home country of Germany with a special gift in store for the city of Dresden. Even though he won't visit that city directly, he'll send the Madonna of Foligno to the Stadice Kunsamlugen Museum in Dresden, where it will remain until January the 8th, 2012. There, the painting will be showcased with the Madonna Sistina, another one of Raphael's masterpieces that's already in Germany. Both pieces were done within a short time of each other, and both show a strong resemblance to one another. The last time the so-called sister paintings were together was probably in Raphael's workshop. Practically anyone visiting the city of Dresden next September can see firsthand Europe's Renaissance at its highest. Despite his long list of accomplishments, Raphael lived a short life. He died when he was only 37 years old. Both of these paintings reflect his unique style. They highlight the strength of the Madonna by showcasing her motherly care. It's bold, yet soft. At the feet of the Madonna, at the left side, the image of children, crowded children, is the same scene Raphael used as a model for the children he painted in the Madonna Sistina. During the four-month exhibit in Germany, other Madonna paintings done by German artists from that same period will also be showcased, along with Raphael's sister paintings.